howdy. Uh, so, so I just came back from a really shitty class in which I played, I think, like an hour, a consecutive hour of random battles. And those are really draining for me, so I'm not going to be ba uh, laddering today. Uh, instead, though, I want to kind of preview a team I'm going to use probably for tomorrow uh, and, and just talk about general like team building and stuff like that. And I might be completely wrong, but uh, if if anybody watching, all like five of you, uh, if you have something you would like to discuss, then drop in the comments here. It's more going to be just a chill session with me picking a team, and throughout the week I'll be workshopping and trying to use it. Let me get some music going. There we go. All right. So as you can see right here, I've got I've got Choice Scarf Landorus because I've, I've hit this thing like out of the ten OU matches I've played, I've hit it nine times off uh, off camera. I'm getting really tired of it, and also like I want to be brainless for a while. I just I, I want to be able to just not think about what I'm doing and win games. So uh, I made this pretty. <laughs> it's called Scum. Uh, it's Fairly, I want to. It's it's been fairly successful so far. It's a hyper offense. Like I said, a choice guy for uh Mix Kurum B with a Draco Meteor over uh, Earth Power. Because you know, I I figure I don't really need it. Uh, most most uh, defensive uh, special defense tanks. Are uh, you know they're either uh, Heatran, which obviously quite effective, like a Gastrodon EQ would probably kill. Um, and yeah, I need a Dragon type move on Dragon Stab, just so it can hit multiple things. And also with a uh, 285 speed and 390 health, I need something to deal with Lottie, or not Lottie, uh, the stupid thing um i'm blanking uh the dragon type that you can't fuck with with ice beam that one yeah okay word uh sure spell. i've got wise glasses raikou which is just if you're not sure uh, choice specs but instead of a bigger bonus it's, it's only like one, times 1.1 but it's still pretty nice uh like i said i have a curum and i have a rotom so like fire i was really lacking fire type coverage so I made this end by our fire instead of ice. We'll see how that goes. It means I can't really fuck with the ground types at all, but uh, with what I had in mind, uh, and also I may be able to scare people out if I play with Raikou correctly. But Raikou is really fun. I love I love it. I like a, a Volt Turn core. It's just really easy to win with. Then I have a Rotom Wash. Moving on. Uh, standard, really standard Mega Metagross with a Pursuit over Grass Knot. Because if they have a Gastrodon, I want them to just completely destroy me. I don't want to have fun. I just want to immediately click X and I'll have an excuse to keep playing. <laughs> and I have Bulky Driller to, uh. Oh, Jesus. I have Bulky Driller to get rid of hazards. I don't have any hazards myself, but everything on this team, bar the Rotom and the Drill, are fast as fuck. So, like, you know, I don't really need it. Uh, don't really need hazards. I, I'd like them, uh, but I have I've wrote him W. I have Kerem B. I've got a Scarf Lando. Like I have enough talent flame counters. Like I think I'll be fine. Mm. Uh, Weavile does a number as well, but it can't knock out Metagross, and I have Hammer Arm. So as long as I, so if they ha the other guys are Weavile, if I play correctly, I should be able to deal with it, and then I'll be fine. Uh. Okay, so one of the things that's been bothering me a lot about OU recently is the fact that, like, everybody and their mother has been... Okay, so, you know how sometimes when something is really good, like Mega Sableye was really good for a while because, there was, because of Goth Stall, uh, everybody uses it, and then as soon as uh, Shadow Tag or Goth Tag gets banned from OU, 
in combination with Mega Sableye or whatever the hell it is, like, everybody immediately jumps off the strategy. People are jumping back onto it, and because of that, every team is super balanced. Like, even the most aggressive thing I've seen is just straight Venusaur balance. That still gets 6 would by Mega Sableye. Mega Sableye is... God, I hate Mega Sableye. I'm probably gonna make a video at some point just talking about Pokemon I hate. <sighs> Which I'll still use, because, you know, self-loathing, and I want points, but... The fact that the only thing I can touch this is Fairy-type, the fact that it's so f stupidly beefy, and the form before it Mega Evolves gets Prankster, so you can... So if they have an Aussie or something, you can just whip out a Willow and you're fine. It's ridiculous. Sableye is the most versatile tank in the entire game. It just it, nothing beats it. Nothing can really one-shot it effectively. Without being like... Choice Band. I think Choice Band Hyperspace Fury doesn't even kill on a not max defense, but like a max HP. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. I'm getting sidetracked though. Uh, yeah, this is... I'm gonna be trying to ladder with this throughout the week. You'll be seeing various results. I might have a video to upload where I'll be joined by this dude named Luke, who's pretty cool, and we'll ghost for each other. And we might be loading some fun teams as well. Uh, you know, I've, Wimps to Specs is pretty fun always, but I'll, but we have stuff like uh, Vanillux, Go Goat, stuff from uh, Joey Pokemon, and I'll be making my own kind of fun squads. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, anyway, sorry, this is kind of a waste of time, to be quite honest, but uh, I just wanted to talk about OU for a while, and like I said, I'm super burnt out from battling all the time. Uh, this upcoming Friday, I have a tournament match. Uh, there's a League of Champions that I just joined, and I might be uploading that depending on A, whether or not I win, and B, whether or not it's boring as fuck, or if it's interesting. Uh, but yeah, apart from that, I will see everybody later. Peace.